I do not encourage or condone the use of tobacco or cannabis products, and if you're under the age of 18, you can go ahead and get out of here right now. Alrighty, so, why are Zippo lighters like this one right here used in movies so much? Today, I'm going to be smoking a little bit of a Nat Sherman Select Yellow, and I'm going to be talking a little bit about that, you know what I'm saying? But I think without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and take a hit, and then I'm going to go ahead and start talking, you know what I'm saying? I'm very, very excited to talk about this. This is something that is super, super interesting to me. And I hope it's super, super interesting to you guys as well, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, I think without further ado, let's go ahead and take a hit or two, you know what I'm saying? Man, tasting good, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, why are Zippo lighters used in movies so much? Well, in my personal opinion, there are four different reasons. I have four different reasons I'm going to be talking about today. The first reason, though, in my personal opinion, is, well, just the look of the Zippo lighter. i got to be completely honest with y'all. It's the look of the Zippo lighter. Zippo lighters are a super classic look, and they, I mean, like, look at it kind of thing. It looks cool, it looks classy, and it's very much a timeless look kind of thing. The design of the Zippo has not really changed much since its uh, invention in, like, the World War One or World War Two. I can't remember exactly when it was invented. i got to be completely honest with y'all. i got to probably figure that out. Out. but the look hasn't changed much and it's a very timeless look because of that the reason it's timeless is because the look hasn't changed because the look is the exact same so wherever whatever movie you're watching whether it's from the 1950s the 1960s the 1970s kind of thing all the way up until now zippo letters can be used and it's not an, a, a recognizable thing about the era kind of thing it's a very timeless design and it makes the character look like they could be from any era i gotta be completely honest with you on it i think it definitely really works very well especially in like sci-fi movies kind of thing when a character is using a zippo letter and it's like 2032 or something like that or something crazy like that and they're still using a zippo letter it works because it's such a timeless design because it hasn't been changed over the last hundred years why would it be changed again in 200 kind of thing it makes perfect sense in my personal opinion the second reason is because of the sound that Zippo, Zippo letters make. I gotta be completely honest with you. It's because of the sound. It gives the audience a audible recognition that a cigarette is being lit without having to see a cigarette being lit on screen. You can have one character talking and the other character lighting up a cigarette, and you don't even have to have to see the person lighting up a cigarette. All you have to do is hear this and this, and all you just know. You just know that a cigarette or a J or something just got lit up or something like that kind of thing. You know that it happened, and, and that really, to me, is one of the one of my personal favorite reasons as to why Zippo is used in movies a lot because it gives the audience who's watching the movie an, an audible reaction kind of thing. They know it's happening without having to see it. And that is one of my favorite parts of storytelling, when you can convey a message, when you can convey something without ever showing it on screen kind of thing. I love that. And Zippo lighters help to do that so much in my personal opinion. The third reason in my personal opinion are the mechanics of the lighter itself. Most lighters, Bix, Clippers, etc. kind of thing, they have a pretty simple mechanic. To actually get a flame, you have to hold down a button. Zippo lighters, on the other hand, the flame stays lit. As we can see here, let's go ahead and flick that like that, and the flame stays lit. I gotta be completely honest with you, the flame just stays like it is kind of thing. That, the mechanics of that kind of thing, how the lighter works, is somewhat unique. I, would, I, I gotta be completely honest with y'all. Most, most cheapy lighters, most lighters within this price point are not like that at all. Bic lighters, clipper lighters, you can't do that kind of thing. The mechanics are not similar enough to do that. Some other lighters, I believe, like Dunhill lighters and stuff like that, they can do that, but those are like $60, $70 lighters, and they're not nearly as iconic as Zippo's. This, when, when you got a character that wants to burn something, like half the time when I see a Zippo lighter, the character just whips it out of their pocket, lights it up, and then throws it kind of thing, because they're like, all right, I need to burn something, or... or commit arson or something like that, you know what I'm saying? That's exactly what the mechanics are so useful for, in my personal opinion, because you can just throw the lighter on the ground. Now, in actuality, you can't throw the lighter on the ground without the flame going out. I know wind Zippo lighters are supposed to be wind-resistant. They are not that wind-resistant, i got to be completely honest with you. Also, it really is not an accurate depiction, in my personal opinion, but the mechanics of it are still accurate in that that is physically possible, technically speaking. And that is the third reason as to why Zippo letters are used in movies so much. In my personal opinion, at least, you know what I'm saying? The fourth reason is product placement. Now, I have no proof about this, but there are Zippo letters in so many movies, and I get it kind of thing. It's timeless. It's got the audible uh, reaction kind of thing. It's got the sound of it. It's got the mechanical uh, aspect as well, where the lighter doesn't go out kind of thing. So I think it's really a combination of all of those that leads it to be in so many movies, but... Who knows? Zippo Lighter could be paying for every single one of those. I gotta be completely honest with y'all. Zippo could be paying for every single one of those. 
if I said I have no proof of that at all, you know what I'm saying? I have no proof of that at all. But those are pretty much the reasons, in my personal opinion, as to why Zippo lighters like this one right here are used in movies so much. And I, I absolutely love Zippo lighters, don't get me wrong. I think Zippo lighters are just about one of my favorite lighters, I gotta be completely honest with you. Bic lighters, they hold a special place in my heart, clippers too, kind of thing. But this lighter, it's such a classic look and I love it because of the, of the sound kind of thing, the sound. I feel like it really helps convey a story without having to show it on screen and I or or say it kind of thing. You can somebody can light a cigarette up in the middle of a movie and they don't have to say, "Oh, I'm lighting up a, a cigarette" kind of thing. They can just open it up, light a cigarette, and everybody knows exactly what they're doing, and it works perfectly fine. And that's probably my favorite reason as to why Zippo letters are used in movies so much. But I think the most relevant reason as to why Zippo letters are used in movies so much is well, the first reason. The first reason is just because of the look of it. The Zippo lighter itself. Is such a classic look, I gotta be completely honest with y'all. It's such a classic look, and it's just such a good little bit of design, I gotta be completely honest with y'all. And it's such a timeless, classic, cool look, I would have to say. And it's very clean, it works well, you don't have to worry about having a logo on it. Everybody knows what it is without having to say it's a Zippo lighter kind of thing. I think it works super well, and that is the main reason, in my personal opinion, as to why Zippo letters are used in movies so much. But as said, the secondary reason, the second most popular reason, the second my my favorite, my second favorite reason. I'm getting my words all jumbled up. I can't be talking today. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what the deal is. You know what I'm saying? But the sound is very important too, in my personal opinion. But yeah, those are pretty much the reasons, in my personal opinion, as to why Zippo letters are used in movies so much. Let me know if you guys have any other reasons. I'm very curious to find out if you guys have any other reasons as to why Zippo letters are used in movies so much, you know what I'm saying? <sighs> I'm sure there's a movie I or I'm sure there's a movie. I'm sure there's something I missed, I gotta be completely honest with you. I'm sure there's some sort of motive I missed or something like that. So let me know if you guys think of any other motives or anything like that. Make sure to comment down below. And if you guys think I was wrong about anything, make sure to comment down below too. Call me out, I don't care kind of thing. I am very open. Or at least I like to think I'm very open. I gotta put it. That, let me put it that way. I like to think I'm very open to constructive criticism. Um, so if you guys think any of these reasons are wrong, make sure to let me know in the comments down below and explain why. But if you guys think I got it, uh, got it right, and you guys think I missed something that uh, could have made this uh, a little bit better, make sure to let me know as well. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Cannot complain in the least though. This Siggy, I'm enjoying it right now. I gotta be completely honest with you. It is a beautiful day today. Cloud, no clouds in the sky. And man. It is nice. It is nice. I gotta be completely honest with y'all. No complaints on my behalf. But, whew. Man. These Nat Sherman Special Selects, I gotta be completely honest with y'all, though. I really am enjoying them. I really do be enjoying them. More than American Spirits, I gotta be completely honest with y'all. More than American Spirits. But, I mean, like, no complaints on my behalf, you know what I'm saying? No complaints on my behalf. I think without further ado, though, I'm gonna go ahead and finish this off in just a moment. I think I got two or three more hits left, so I'm gonna go ahead and take those, and then I'm gonna go ahead and end the video right there. Let's go to y'all. But I hope you guys are having an absolutely fantastic day. As said, I know I am. It is an absolutely beautiful day out here. Nothing to complain about. This is my second cigarette of the day. Smoked a uh, smoked, smoked a, a different cigarette earlier today. I did not smoke one of these, but I'm very glad to be smoking one of these right now. You know what I'm saying? But as said, I hope you guys are having an absolutely fantastic day. And if you guys aren't, well, I hope this video can just make your day a little bit better. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? But man, no complaints on my behalf, though. But Zippo letters, they're just... I love Zippo lighters kind of thing. That's why I've made I've made a couple I've made I've made a, I've made a few videos on Zippo lighters and I'm like there's a reason as to why I like Zippo lighters so much and and the reason really the reason why I like the Zippo lighters so much is the sound and it's the mechanics and it's it's the look of it kind of thing. That's why I like Zippo lighters so much and that's why I'm assuming a lot of other people like Zippo's lighters so much too. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, I think without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and take one more hit, and then I'm going to go ahead and end the video right there, because it looks like it is approaching the filter. i got to be completely honest with y'all. It is getting a little bit yellow, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. Ooh, man. Tasted some filter on that last hit. Not a good experience at all. i got to be completely honest with y'all. But thank you very much for watching this video, guys. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe for more content. i got my Instagram, my book, my merch, everything in the description down below. Go check it all out, you know what I'm saying? But yeah. Thank you for watching. Until the next one, y'all, stay safe and peace and have a great one. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Yes, sir.